Alright, got some sad news guys. Uh, on my way to work today, hit a rain spot and S2000 spun out. Pretty sure it's totaled. Uh, I'll show you guys the damage once I get uh, to record the car. I do have some pictures, but I'd rather just record it once I get there. Um, let me clean this lens off real quick. Uh, fortunately, I came out alright. Just a few scratches all over my arms. A few minor cuts over here as well. Uh, nothing serious, but looks like he will be losing that S2000 and gonna have to search for another one again so yeah that's the status report for today but I'll get back to you guys soon enough alright guys stay safe out there Here's what she looks like now. Here's gone. pretty much all over. So, that's the deal with that. Here to get the mileage to finally settle on a dang price for this car. So far not happy with how the insurance has handled this, but I might make a separate video on that. Alright, so I'm sitting inside a Project Adam at the moment. Um, Finally got everything settled with the insurance company uh, for the S2000. Um, like I mentioned before, I really dislike the way they handled everything. Um, for one, like uh, I don't feel like they sent anybody to actually uh, assess the value of the car. Uh, they said they did, but I don't know how. Um, because pretty much the car stayed the whole time at a tow yard. Um, and I know f when, uh, Project Adam got hit, uh, with the deer, um, they at least took it to a body shop and assessed the damage there and all that, told me, gave me, you know, price on the labor, price on... How much it was going to take to paint it and all that. Uh, with this, it was just, hey, the car's totaled. So, I feel like that was kind of, you know, half-ass on their part. Um, also, at first, they were only trying to give me 10. And I was like, hold up. I know I can go, yeah, way more than that. Um, so, I'm not sure where they got that value from. Um, I definitely fought back on that, and I was able to get, uh, a, uh, better return. Um, but also just, just in general, like, 
I feel like the the dude that was taking care of my claim just was just like eh. Because like uh, when I had to send my title in, he didn't give me any information on how to do it. I had a call, and somebody else had to pretty much get in contact with him, uh, so they could send me the stuff. And then when I was in the process of about to send it, uh, he sends me an email uh, showing the old claim value of ten thousand. I was like, hold up, that's not what we had said. Hold on. So, we had to get that straight away. Um, but, like I said, finally got it all settled out. Um, still looking for NS2000. I'm probably going to settle on a black one this time. It's the color I've always wanted. Um, uh, and third time's a charm, I guess. So... Hopefully this one <laughs> lives a little longer than all the other ones. Um, definitely seem to have bad luck in the rain with the S2000s. Um, so I'm probably going to make a video on that. Um, just focusing on the importance of tires and your tire thread. Just showing how important keeping up with your tires really is. Um, I think that's it for this video. Uh, definitely was upset about losing this too. I really have big plans for it. Um, but hopefully we can continue the plans when we get a new one. So that's it. I hope you guys are taking care. Drive safe out there. Um, always wear your seatbelt. If you guys aren't subscribed, please do subscribe and like the button. If you guys like the content, don't forget to share it. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Alright guys.